Welcome to the show. I'm Kathy Ireland. One storage company wants to do more than give you a clean and convenient environment to store your things. Chris Burnham, president of Storage Mart, wants to make a difference for both customers and the community. Welcome, Chris. Well, thanks, Kathy. I'm glad to be here. Well, Chris, can you tell us how Storage Mart is so much more than a place to keep your belongings? Well, sure. It, Kathy, have you ever rented a storage unit before? Yes. You know, it's kind of a hassle sometimes. Yes. And we recognize that it's probably on the last thing on anyone's to-do list that they really want to do at any given time. So how can we make it easier for our customers? You know, how can we make that transition in life just as smooth as possible? And we think that's what makes Storage Mart a great company and a great place to do business. Well, Chris, what are some of the, the special features that you offer your customers? Kind of the watchwords for our company are easy, clean service. And I think first off is just easy. We want to make it so easy to rent a storage unit. Pick up your smartphone with a few clicks. You can rent a unit, come in whenever you need to come in. I think that that's the type of thing that consumers really want to see nowadays. Cleanliness, mm. you know, making something so clean that it feels like an extension of your own home. You know, so you really feel comfortable putting your stuff in there. I mean, frankly, some storage facilities are just not well kept right. and are kind of yucky inside. We don't want to be that company. We always want to have a white glove kind of cleanliness at our facilities. Drive-in loading bays where you can do all of your loading out of the weather or the elements. Mm -hmm. You know, we do business in places like Toronto, New York, Minnesota, Texas, and Florida where it's hot as well. Getting out of the elements is a real a real plus. Climate controlled space uh, that really keeps your, your belongings you know, nice and fresh, so I, I think that's a great thing. Things just to make it a safe place and make it well lit. A type place that on a dark February evening you wouldn't mind going by and picking up whatever you needed out of your storage unit and it would be a good atmosphere for that. What customers are looking for in cell storage units would be quality, a great price, a secure facility with great staff. Storage Mart meets those needs by providing a well-constructed facility, a clean facility. The moment you walk into these offices, you clearly see that this place is unlike any other facility that you've been to. Storage Mart has been really good for me. The staff is really friendly. I feel like my things are safe. I think that my things are uh, well taken care of, easily accessible at different times of the day, whenever it's convenient for you. It's a good place. I use Storage Mart both for business and for our personal use. So for business, I, we stored our trailers for our church uh, that had a lot of equipment, so we wanted to make sure it was protected and safe, and we felt comfortable the whole time it's been with Storage Mart. And then for personal use, I had to move, and so to be able to storage temporarily and utilize it until our move, it just worked out perfectly. We've stayed ahead of the curve to be an industry leader by implementing some in-house tools, one of those being our value pricing program. We have different options of storage units available for customers. They can essentially choose what's best for them. No matter where you store, whether it's with Storage Mart or someone else, you're going to have to have coverage on your goods. And we have an in-house program where if something were to happen to your property, we kind of serve as an advocate to help you when the unforeseen happens. We've really pioneered the self-storage industry. We really pride ourselves on providing easy, clean service to our customers as well as to our employees and by implementing things like our value coverage and our value pricing program, we've really set the trend for other self-storage companies to follow. Chris, what are important things that people should consider when they're choosing a storage company? Sure. First off, they have a choice. Mm -hmm. Be smart. Do some shopping. And don't just pick what looks like a great deal online. Um, be familiar with the property if you can. Because, you know, they're not all created equal. You know, when you get on site and you start looking around and you start saying, hmm, this place looks a little dingy or a little dodgy. Didn't look like that online, did it? Or come by and just see how great a facility can be because the modern storage products that are being built in this country now are really quite fantastic, especially compared to the product that was coming out, say, 20 or 30 years ago. Chris, how is Storage Mart staying green-minded? didn't necessarily start out to be green. We started because it was just good business sense, mm -hmm. and we call it upcycling. What we do is when we develop a new facility, a lot of times we'll buy an existing piece of real estate. Most recently, we took over an old grocery store in Kansas City. Rather than tear that grocery store down and fill up half a landfill with the rubble, mm -hmm. uh, we looked at it and we said, you know, we think we can convert this to a self-storage use. And we ended up with a state-of-the-art facility in uh, a great part of Overland Park, Kansas. Um, 
We did the same thing with an eight-story hotel in New Orleans, Louisiana, once upon a time. We've done it with auto dealerships and other disused or derelict buildings that we can come in and bring new life to. And whenever we get the, the chance to do that, it's kind of a fun, interesting design project trying to figure out how to make everything work. So, yeah, we really thrive on, on those types of activities. Great. It's wonderful. It helps the environment and, as you mentioned, uh, very economical as well. It's That's beautiful. right. You know, and if you think about all of the rooftops mm -hmm. in self-storage. I mean, you know, that's that's the one thing we have are a lot of roofs. Right. Uh, perfect spot for solar panels. Mm. Uh, and uh, we've done a lot of solar panel initiatives, uh, particularly in Ontario and in other parts of the United States as well. Oh, great. Chris, can you tell us about your international growth? We had heard about storage in Canada several years ago and we began researching it. And we found uh, a great opportunity. We found that customers were not being served to the full extent that we serve them here in the United States. And we thought that we could bring some features of our business to the Canadian storage consumer. They've embraced it and it's been an extremely successful play for us. We now have about 70 locations throughout uh, Canada. And most recently, we started looking at the United Kingdom. I had actually been looking at the United Kingdom for about 15 years. and kept getting close to getting a deal done, but never quite closed it. Maybe by hook or crook, in 2016, we closed our first transaction in the United Kingdom. So we now have 16 locations in the southeast of England. Storage Mart provides facilities that are really, really easy for the customer to get into and use. We also put more trust in our customers. We don't ask them to pay a deposit because we assume that they have a need for self-storage and their use of our centre will meet the need they have. We provide that ultimate customer service. We keep our moving costs extremely low. We make it really easy for the customer to move in and we help them every single step of the way. We cater for both business and domestic customers, so perhaps people that are moving house, maybe somebody might need some extra space at home. Businesses might need to source stock, equipment, archives, the list really is endless. It's clean, it's modern. Customer service is excellent. Everyone is always very warm and friendly and helpful should you need it. And if I have any problems or any questions about the storage facility, then I'll always go to someone who will give me all the information that I need. It would be an easy choice if you check out other storage facilities. You will go back to Storage Mart as your first choice every time. My experience with Storage Mart has been superb from the day from day one. They're helpful, considerate. I get courtesy calls to let them know when I've had delivery. They put it away for me in the store. I would recommend them to anybody. Storage Mart would be the place to go. They were able to suit our needs when we needed them. When we first arrived, they weren't doing 24 hour access for everyone, but they knew we needed that. So they were able to do that for us, give us the code so we were able to enter our unit at any point. They're fantastic. For whatever you need, they're just brilliant, absolutely wonderful. If I was to describe Storage Mart in one word, it would be leaders. Um, we are one step ahead of the competition. We don't charge a deposit, we offer complete flexibility, we offer easy monthly billing, and this really is all backed up in our motto of easy clean service. Chris, can you describe Storage Mart's focus on family during transitions? Sure. Nobody likes to move. Uh, you know, life events are what really trigger the need for my business. You know, somebody's getting married or maybe someone's passed away, uh, new birth, a new job. Mm -hmm. Maybe you're buying your first home. Maybe you've had your home foreclosed on. Those are all events that trigger a need for self-storage. And we know that not everybody needs storage all the time, but when they do, we want to make sure that we're there. It's easy. It's a no-hassle experience because, frankly, we all have so much on our plate on a daily basis. Do we really need one more problem? So if, if we can be a part of that solution, you know, we just think that's great for for families and, uh, and for people, entrepreneurs, new businesses, right. all of those things. Oh, wonderful. Chris, can you talk about your charitable partnerships with the American Red Cross, with FAST, Cancer Research UK, Big Brothers, Big Sisters Canada? Sure. Well, you know, we actually cover three different countries, the United States, Canada, and the United Kingdom, and we want to be charitable 
um, uh, participants mm -hmm. in each of those markets. Uh, so big brothers and big sisters in Canada, you know, great worthy organization, uh, Cancer Research in the UK, we're really proud to announce them as being one of our more recent partners. In the US, the Red Cross does a lot of great things for so right. many people. And recently, we have partnered with FAST, which is the foundation for Angelman Syndrome Therapeutics. Now, Angelman Syndrome is a neurogenetic disorder. It's actually been identified as being perhaps one of the most curable neurogenetic disorders. And they're literally around the corner from a, a cure for these kids. And you know, the thought that we could be a part of that mm. is a great feeling, and we're happy to do it. Chris, can you explain your Store It Forward campaign? Sure, you know, that's a program where we take self-storage units mm -hmm. and lease them out for a dollar a month to local charities. We actually partner with over 175 local charities that are based right in the areas where we do business. And it's just our way of kind of giving a little extra back. I think last year we donated over $300,000 in self-storage rent back to local charities. That's wonderful, congratulations to you. Thank you. When my daughter Grace was diagnosed three years ago with Angelman syndrome, my wife and I knew we wanted to be a part of the cure and our best opportunity to do that was to be a part of FAST. Storage Mart has been an amazing partner in the cure for Angelman syndrome. Uh, their online marketing brings awareness and their generosity has been exceptional in funding the university-based research that we're doing to bring a cure. It's funding the research that will bring a cure to Grace and so many other kids. Chris, you run a large family-owned company. How does your value of family translate into your company culture as an employer? Sure. I like to think that we're just fairly easygoing about things. If you're in our office at any given time, you might see somebody's kids who are there you know, because they're, you know, in between doctor's appointments or something like that, and, and they'll bring the kids to the office, and, you know, and that's, that's cool with us. You gotta be there for folks. You gotta understand them. But more than anything, I think it's just being a, a platform for growth and personal development, and to help give people the opportunities and training that make them, you know, better employees. I think that investing in human capital is something that we don't do enough uh, in American business right now. To the extent we can do that, it's good for the employee, and you know what, we'll probably make money off of it. Right. So that's good. Oh, wonderful, so Chris, what's next for Storage Mart? Well, we're gonna continue to look for new opportunities. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, we're at about 220 stores uh, in uh, three countries today. That makes us the largest privately owned self-storage company in the world. Congratulations. Well, thanks, uh, and uh, we're gonna keep growing. And to the extent uh, we can find great people and great opportunities, we'll be looking for maybe a Storage Mart near you soon. Wonderful. We look forward to that. And Chris, it sounds like Storage Mart is providing a great service while helping so many people. Congratulations and wish you continued success. Thank you so much. Thank you. And thank you for watching. I'm Kathy Ireland.